Hey everyone, Solid is here. Welcome back. So this one is kind of unique case. Um, normally when I launch this game with DKFMGen command, it just freezes during loading screen, either right after I hit play or as soon as I press continue from the main menu, it just freezes. But with a simple trick, we can actually get FSFO working and fix the freezing issues. I have tested it. It is perfectly working so far. I've been getting a pretty stable 60 to 70 FPS on all high settings and the game is pretty fun on Steam Deck. So all we need is Deck from Gen and LSFG. If you need installation process, check out my previous guides. Here are my LSFG settings for this game. Make sure that disable Steam Deck mode from here is turned off. This game just uh, hates it. Now copy the lsfg plus dkfg command and paste it into the game launch option. Under compatibility select proton experimental since in my test it gives a better frame rate overall. From controller layout map the insert key to any button. I have set it to the left trackpad but any of the back grip button also works. Ok launch the game. Now it might freeze at any point but don't worry we just need to launch it once with dkframgen command so all the OptiScalar files get generated inside the game's installation folder. Everything is set to high and FSI is set to prioritize performance will keep DLSS disabled. You can see the rest here. Now let's click insert key, bring the OptiScalar menu, set it to FSR4 from here. Also optionally you can set the sharpness from here to 1.0 which helps the image quality even more. Click save INI and, and close it. Now if I click continue, the game will likely freeze again at the loading screen, let's see. And there it is, the loading stops. So we're just going to close it from Steam. Let's go back to game's launch option and remove the DKFG command. This part and only keep the LSFG command. Now let's relaunch the game. Quick double check. Settings looks good. DLSS is grayed out now. Since we are not using the command and spoofing hardware anymore, that's expected. And Steam Deck mode is showing here, good. But we have already set custom settings at all high, so just leave it disabled. Now let's hit continue. Great, no freezing this time. You can also disable LSFG frame gen if you don't want to use it. That will leave you with around 30 to 40 FPS on average, which is also not bad as raw performance. So, what is actually happening here? When we first launch the game with Deck frame gen command, it generates those uh, OptiScalar files. Then, even after we remove the command, the OptiScalar menu still works, letting us use the upscalar pass through from in game FSR 2 and bump it up to FSR 4. That command basically spoofs the device hardware ID, making the game think we are playing it on an NVIDIA GPU. For example, as a result, we see DLSS option on Steam Deck. But what I think is on Steam Deck, this game tailored for the DX hardware specifically. And when it gets spoofed, that hardware mismatch probably caused some technical conflicts. And as a result, it freezes. But once we remove the command, there is no more hardware spoofing. The OptiScalar pass-through stays active and that's exactly what we need to enable FSR 4 using the in-game FSR 2. Overall the game is really well optimized on Steam Deck. Kudos to the devs for making it Steam Deck verified at launch. So there you have it. Hope this helps. See you in the next one.